Please, you know my hands are free, it just leaves me. No, no, Ben, 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 not for my... Stop, Ben, put me down. Ben! I bet you I can jump from this couch to the counter. Check it. Eagle! Maybe in the morning. Carol's family had welcomed me as one of their own, no more so than her brother Larry. Eagle! I told you not to call me Lawrence! And I told you I never get dizzy! <laughs> what the hell did you follow me here? A friend dropped me off. Eagle! JD! I'm telling you, you guys should daydream more often. All you have to do is tilt your head to the left and then let your mind run free like an eagle. As I wondered if I looked that stupid when I fantasized, I decided to check on Mr. Templeton. There's gotta be a way I could get on Sports Center. Dr. Cox is athletic. I wonder if he could help. What is going on? Involuntary luge. Oh! oh! That's gonna hurt. Glory always does. Today was the fifth anniversary of the time Turk and I met David Caruso on a Ferris wheel. Usually to celebrate, Turk would lift me in the air while I straddled him and yelled, Eagle! But this morning, I somehow knew that wasn't gonna happen. Hey. Hey. Eagle. I just got the urge to buy you a shirt. Well then, to the mall! Mount up. What are those pads for? Those pads there, my friend, are for you to fall on. In honor of your departure, I'm about to give you your final full turbo spinning eagle. Oh, prepping for takeoff. Excellent. Now, did you get my text about not eating after midnight last night? Yeah, all I've had is mouthwash. Let's do this, come on! Mounting. Three, two, one, <laughs> eagle, eagle. Are these two doctors? I'm afraid so. Never stop spinning me! Eagle! <laughs> find the pad! I can't find it! Dude! Follow my voice! I'm coming! There's another hospital down about three miles that way. 